What is up everyone? Welcome back to some more Horizon Forbidden West. Let's jump right into it. Aloy! It's been a while since we were here. The of JTF-10 in the mountainous regions of the hot zone. Well met, Aloy. Aww. I was hoping we'd run into each other again after the flood and bleeding mark. Atika. So you did it. You're part of the Chief's Guard now. It wasn't an easy choice, but yes. That would be a hard choice. After you left, we laid Kentok to rest, and I thought about what he said. He served his clan, his tribe, as best as he could. I have to do the same. I'm sure he'd be proud. And he'd reprimand me for allowing myself to be distracted. <laughs> <laughs> Can't have that. <laughs> Thank you again, Aloy. Strike true as the ten. Oh, I have to also have more stuff to give to you. It's been a hot minute. Are you the only one listening to these voices? Oh, no. The others who captured the Osiram Delver heard the voices from these ancient warriors, too. They spread the word, and now a lot of people are talking about them. <laughs> Soldiers are interested in old battles. <laughs> Tall is definitely proof of that. I have more voices for you to preserve. You honor the fallen. <laughs> okay. Well. Okay, might as well just get the tail. And maybe another one of these. Cool. Thank you. I will make sure the story of these soldiers is told again. What will you do with the recordings? Well, I'll have to speak to my superiors and see if we can make space for them. They aren't from the Ten, but the voices of all warriors must be heard and remembered. Hmm. I hope you find what you want from these recordings. Nice. The visions will guide us. Moments later, the entire grove was filled with white. Like the days of the first Tenoch. Even more, the truth of the visions was revealed to us. Then, we gathered here and listened to Faraday's words. And this was the same message Chief Hikaro saw. Oh, yes. Unity against our common struggles. Peace instead of war. I wish I could have seen it. Aloy, I was just telling Cabo <laughs> how you revealed the visions after Regala's attack on the cool route. I've always wondered what Chief Hikaro saw and heard the day he conquered the grove. Now we know. I'm sorry you don't get to see it too. It's okay. I know a chaplain who was there. The deeds of the Ten have <laughs> always inspired us in battle. Now, they will guide us towards peace as well. All thanks to you, Aloy. No. Where else am I going? Oh, there's a quest over there. There's two unknowns over here too, and an unknown back there. Oh, I've seen this one. Buena Vida Appearance. Micah, you'd better hear this from me. Remember Sonia Buenavida, the aide to Senator Maria Mendina? She just did an interview going on a how about how unfit you are to lead the museum due to a confirmed bias towards government history. She's accusing us of erasing bias towards, oh wait, she's accusing, of, accusing us of erasing Roberta, Ro, God damn it, I can't read, Roberto Medina's legacy by substituting his heroic effort to curb the government's reliance on machine power with both sides narrative that deflects from the real issue of federal overreach. I know Bonavita is a hothead, so I'm not surprised by her wording, but we should be concerned. As an aide to Maria Medina, she could probably sway her aban to abandon support for the museum, and you know as well as I do how fragile Senator support is at the moment. Losing a vote is one thing, but we can't afford to lose Roberta Medina's daughter. The symbol symbolism alone would shatter the hopes of our future funding. Please advise on our PR strategy. Maria Medina's visit is due in two weeks. The timing couldn't be worse for us. 
Wrong. What you got for me? I've heard of you, the must be. Whoa, that's not the direction I went <laughs> when I started sliding. I see it. <laughs> Causes of the conflict. By now, we all know the story. In the 2030s, as rising temperatures baked the desert southwest, the federal government ordered a controver controversial evacuation. When residents of the three affected states refused to leave, their protest was championed by rare earth magnate Robert Roberto Medina and Joint Task Force 10 pilot Colonel Edward de la Hoya. The ensuing struggle escalated into the first full-scale engagement between automated forces and human soldiers in world history, not to mention the first military campaign fought on American soil since Civil War. But the ultimate change wasn't the only but the climate change wasn't the only cause. Water rights, the politics of urban versus rural states, and the increasing demand for rare earth materials by US tech companies also contributed to the crisis. This exhibit is designed to broaden our thinking to consider all of the factors that led to the tragic events of August 20th, 2037, in the hope that we don't fall for the same problems in the future. Oh, there's another one over here, too. What's this one? Feedback. Much of the gun at all, jamming all the time before it blew up in our face. What on earth is it doing in the museum? If there's a hell for guns, it belongs there. <laughs> Gracias, por favor. Preserve. I don't know how to speak Spanish. <laughs> My husband and I were pleasantly surprised by the serenity of the crater and its current form, a telling landmark after all these years. It silenced a stark contrast to the violence of bygone days. Joy was here in the in here wide midbedoter, but he's. A what? <laughs> Medina this. Medina that is all I hear in every exhibit. My father knew the Medinas from when they were still hauling rare earth in Arizona. Let me tell you, them folks ain't the heroes of the story. Of any story. Interesting. Hello? Champion, I fear we must lean on your strength and generosity again. Just tell it to her straight, Ducca. The tribe needs the arena. She's our only hope to getting it open again. You need the arena? But the cool route's over. That's true, but we also use the arena to boost the tribe's morale. We use it for training. Herd in machines so our soldiers can experience the glory of the kill in a controlled setting. Which, of course, boosts morale. <laughs> Chief Hikaru won't let us reopen the arena until the ballista protecting the field is repaired. We need it in case a machine runs amok, and it was damaged during the cool route. The parts we need aren't easy to find. I get it. We need to hunt down some machines and grab the parts. We'd ask someone else, but every squad in the Grove is on alert. But the task is not without compensation, right, Kala? Of course. Once the arena is open again, I would be honored to invite you to compete. A wide variety of machines will be available. Interesting. And I will award you prizes for victory. Not just from the arena, but also for medals won at hunting grounds. You'll be able to trade them for some of the tribe's very best gear. To fix the ballista, we'll need a sinew from a roller bag, along with some bristleback tusks. I got a shit ton of those. Both kinds of machines have been spotted near a campfire to the southeast. You can bring the parts back to me here when you're done. I don't know if I have another one. I'll see what I can I do. definitely have bristles. One more thing. If you're going back into the wilds, I have another duty tied to our soldiers' morale. A regrettable one. Every Tanakh soldier carries a tag carved Ooh, with their so squad symbol. this is what symbol. the tags are for. Rebels have been hoarding the tags of the soldiers. Yeah, I have like 30. You might find such tags at any enemy outpost. If you do, Bring them to me. Oh, I will. I'll make sure they're returned to the soldier squad mates and loved ones. Having confirmation sometimes soothes their grief. And there are bounties involved, if that matters to you. I've already found some of those tasks. Tremor tusk. Here, a small reward for your efforts. But don't let your guard down. There are still many outposts in the wilds. Thank you, champion. And please don't forget the parts for the ballista. 
I won't. I had a good run at the hunting grounds the other day. Earned a half stripe. Finding those cards, champion. Full stripe or don't even bother. Opening the arena. Nice. Yeah, I just need to go to the roller back side. I want to talk to the lady. Really. The time it would take me to get a full strike out of trial, the from the I could earn three and a half strikes. Have machines thrashing about and no way to put them down. Aloy, need to turn in some tags or trade some medals. Maybe you won some from hunting grounds. But if you want to turn in the parts, we need to open the arena. We'll have to talk to Kala. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh. Sorry, I don't actually have any tags right now. No problem. That was kind of funny. Let me though. know when you find some. <laughs> that looked hilarious. Ooh. 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 I'll have none. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> I'm buying this. It's going to replace that because I never use that. <laughs> so, <laughs> might as well put something that I'm actually going to use. And then I'm going to do these because I want this. Well, we'll see how this one goes. I really like the one I have because it's a... <sighs> it's status effects. So, I like that. I mean, this one has one, but it probably does good damage. I mean, I'll still buy it. <laughs> oh, wait a second. I might not buy it and buy one of these. That one's not bad. That one's kind of cute, too. I like the colors on that one. I don't know. We'll see. Oh! <laughs> Look at all these goodies over here. <laughs> Good luck on the hunt. I'll see you later. Well, I guess I should back. go. Trust me. Safe travels. I'm gonna get this open right now. After I read this. <laughs> the arena. Carefully written with Karja glyphs of Fashavs. Aww. Every time I set foot here in the arena, I'm taken back to my own coal route. At the time, I couldn't be sure why Hakata would allow me to partake in the trial. I hoped the chief was obliged to let me enter, but instead he seemed merely intrigued. I won't lie, I enjoyed the obvious frustration of the other contestants. Highborn though I may be, I know how to kill. One desert Tignoth could not, couldn't contain his discontent. As I stood bloodstained over a prone machine, about to kill it, he blindsided me, spearing both its head and my calf. The crowd cheered. Me, not so much. Smug he as he was, he even turned around to take in the ovation. I used that moment to break the spear to free myself. He did not take kindly to that, nor to the fact that I used half of his weapon to impale his foot. I was already to leave at it at that, but he wanted to continue the brawl. I didn't notice that all the machines had been destroyed. It was just us. The onlookers yelled angrily when the bout started leaning my way. Other contestants closed in on me, but Hakado's voice boomed through the arena. Leave them. He who draws first must face the consequences. A long minute passed as we wrestled without rules or grace. With every last, with the very last of my strength, I snapped his neck. The whole place fell silent. Then Hikaru walked up to the edge of the arena and spoke. We fight shoulder to shoulder. We do not stab our fellow soldiers in the back. We must look at our enemies in the eye as one. It took me a while before I realized he was talking about the division between the clans. Even so, I'll never forget how he gave me an enemy general a fair chance. It is why I served him wholeheartedly. And now Chief Hikaru has given me leave to return to the Sundom. The embassy is only days away. From then on, I will do everything in my power to broker a lasting peace for our people. Hikaru, this has been the grandest of the adventures. Goodbye, my friend. Aww. Uh -huh. oh. <laughs> Why you gotta go like that? Guess I need to head southeast to find that roller back. I already have enough bristleback tusks on me. Yeah, I know we do. We have a ton. Items for collection. To whom it may concern, my late husband Kana Mungrove perished with the Roberta Medina at the Battle of Mojave. When his last leave was hastily recalled, he left his duffel bag at the house. 
It holds the unusual or the usual items, but also devices with data, snaps of his unit, a collection of maps in marching orders, including the one ordering his squad to join Medina. He even kept a couple of small G sin G syndrome parts we think he took as souvenirs. Kana proudly spoke at of taking down several. We were wondering, would the museum be interested in said items for the collection? My family would feel honored if we, the memory is thus preserved. Respectfully, yours, Kate Mungrove. Awaits you here. Dude, why is this music so intense? I read some of these already. I think I like sniped them through the wall. Yeah. <laughs> I sniped some of these through the wall. <laughs> what could it be? That machine looks like it could flatten the what level are you? trees. Me too. Me. Me. Oh, no one cared, okay. <laughs> Time to salvage that scene. There. I should get back to Kella. Hand over the parts. I'm here. I did. I've got the parts you need for the ballista. Excellent. We'll get it fixed up right away, and then the arena will be ready. You're welcome to fight any time. How does it work? Simply speak to me, and I'll arrange a challenge for you. And any medals you win from fighting, you can exchange with me for some of the tribe's very best oh, equipment. Yeah. Not just from the arena, but also medals won at hunting grounds. After upgrading your gear, I think you'll come to favor me over Kala. <laughs> oh, I already do. train our squads. Is that a popularity contest? <laughs> Good thing for you. <laughs> oh. I'll take my leave then. Come talk to me if you win or if you have soldiers' tags to turn in. Well, I already turned well, them then, on. Well so. then, if you'd like to fight in the arena now, we can set it up in no time. So I want now. I'll give it a shot. Right now. Take Good. Me. We'll reopen with the champion in the ring. Hell yeah, okay. Are you ready to put your machine hunting skills at the ultimate test? Jump into the arena and take on the strongest machines in escalating challenges. Complete challenges to earn arena medals that can be traded to the prize master of the unique and extremely powerful gear. Choose your weapon and tend to your health before entering the arena. You won't get a chance to do so once inside. Let's do the amateur. We're gonna do all of them. There's no stopping. <laughs> Get ready. This is a long part. I'm actually excited for this, because... Do I just take out the machines? Do I have to do it a certain way? Let me just stop. Uh, load everything up really quick. <laughs> Kill the machine. Start by jumping into the arena. Okay. 
Well, might as well get a quick look at them, right? We used to work well if I hit it with a shock arrow. Mm -hmm. to get that armor off sometimes. Oh, I didn't get another attack after that tail swipe. They did six times. <laughs> I was like, he's got to be done by now, right? That is hitting his tail. I'm just gonna freeze your butt. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Hell yeah. Machine reinforcements. This challenge locks in all your gear you're currently have equipped. Ah, oh, you gotta be Aw, how did it, it jump above it? Are you joking me? I couldn't aim any higher, Aloy? Come on. You can aim higher, I know you. I got it doesn't cancel the matter that time. that coming because of that stupid chicken attack. I hate that. <laughs> Anything that distorts hearing and visuals is so annoying. It hurts my eyes in, in real life. <laughs> I don't like it. It's Molly's favorite. Okay, that one's done. I like how I was more stunned than it was. <laughs> I was more stunned than it had been from that component coming off. It instantly recovered. I like this outfit that I have on. It's nice. Why is it called rematch? It's just a slither thing. This is probably either gonna go really good or really bad. <laughs> Yeah. Like, that's what drives me crazy about it. Like, I don't even know what the fuck's happening because I'm stuck in the boss. <laughs> like, come on. At least give me a better camera. The worst enemy. Just based off how glitchy it is. It is awful. I didn't even know that was a alien attack like that. Oh, look how close that was. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> that one was so close. <laughs> Might as well shoot the booty. I'm not giving up. <laughs> I was like, that thing is like protecting me right now. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Nice. Did I get it? <laughs> I don't know if I got it. The shell snapper was like, I'm just gonna end this entire career. I did, wow. That was my time. <laughs> Look at that time. Those look like regardless people. Of course. He's got rebels. Always next to my stupid thing, too. Damn it, just hit the back of him. Oh my. Like, what is he doing? He's like, waddle, waddle, waddle. Like, what? What is that movement? <laughs> what was that movement? That was so weird. I'd rather go might be better for now until I upgrade this one. Put the spear. Push up! Overwhelm them! Soldiers are oh. attacking the rebels. Oh, nice. I think he is in Whoa! Whoa! More like they're coming to help me. <laughs> They'll try to get around us. Yeah, out of here. Uh, it's not over yet. <laughs> What do you mean a word? We're not done fighting. It takes so long to to not. Watch out! Okay, is that all of them? <laughs> Are we done? Can I have the bonfire now? <laughs> You know, the thing I came over here just to grab. Wasn't expecting a full-on battle. <laughs> Ooh. Hair as red as the blight. I knew my eyes weren't playing tricks on me. You're Aloy. It was the Karo's <laughs> champion. My name's like, Gatak, the fuck leader you of Fox Squad for the Lowland Clan. Sorry for our unannounced entrance. I'll take Looks it. Looks like you were well prepared. Lowlanders know how to use the element of surprise to their advantage. So we get the job done. Are you here to take back Fenrise? Fenrise? A lowland village southwest of here. Yeah, I actually was taken over by rebels. <laughs> That's exactly what I was going I to do. I assume the chief sent you to reclaim it. I'm sorry, I'm just passing through. To get there. <laughs> My squad's been cutting their supply lines where we can. But eventually, we'll have to attack the village directly. You want to we do it with use me? a soldier like you. If I'm in the area, I'll see what I can do. May the ten see to it. Oh, I'll be there. But That's exactly go, where I was heading. So. I'm sure Chief Hikaru would hate it if his own clan didn't thank you for <laughs> what you've done in the fight against Regala. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> May our next meeting be in victory. I like her outfit. Where's that outfit? I want that outfit. Some of these rebels have a thunder jaw. Really? <laughs> They would. Does everyone have helmets on? Back them up! We're loose! 
losing ground. You see nothing, I swear. I'm not hiding in here. Oh god. What are you holding? Oh my god, it's like the one weapon. Alive? Jesus. <laughs> oh god. I'm scared. <laughs> Don't notice me. What are they doing here? But this other Thunder John didn't even care that they were here. Rebels. We found it. it. Looks like they've taken over an entire village. Jesus. Yeah, we. I should there. take a look around. See what they're up to. Is there anyone even over here? Had like be any more behind that. <laughs> I can't even hit her. I was trying to hit your head. There we go. I got it. <laughs> she, she had a, a hard one to hit. If I time it right, I can take out that guard at the gate. Keep it open long enough for me to get through. You don't see me though, do you? You got one of us. I don't think that one saw me, but just happened to hit me. <laughs> I think that's what happened. We finish it. No more of you. Made it. Oh. Time to find where we can charge. Oh, no. Figure out what's going on in this camp. Right there. Aha. Uh -huh. Found ya. <laughs> this looks so funny. Bam. Looks like the rebels are using this place to train their troops. Bam. Bam. But you're alive? Oh, now you're not. Is that all of them? No, it's not. It never is. You like it? Huh? <laughs> you like being shot? Did you get away? Get back. Let her have it. You gotta be careful because they might one shot me. you get for having such a big freaking head your helmet is such an easy target I'll go for the ankles if I must Sounds are here I 
Better take a look around. No sign of her here. Shoot out! Kill the Outlander! I'm confused about that. <laughs> I think my other bow doesn't work. Okay, whoever is shooting me at the side, you are annoying. <laughs> that was like your eighth shot. An eye for an eye. Target hit. Who is that? It's you. Just die. <laughs> they shoot like 30 arrows at one time. <laughs> I'm just not expecting that many arrows. Good night. On her! Oh, you're down there. I don't even know. There we go. Is that all? Right, they're gone. Nice. Should I be looking around? That looks important. Might be their command center. Up there, yeah. Why is it not? <laughs> Shouldn't it be activated? Yeah. There we go. And activated, I did. I'm curious to see what they have to say now. To all engineers and operatives, return immediately to First Forge. Mm -hmm. Clearly none of you are competent enough to deal with that blasted Nora. So we'll continue to work where she can't get to us. And in the unlikely event that she does, I'll have the pleasure of dealing with her personally. <laughs> I wish you luck, Savior of Meridian. Sarah has a base. If I can find it, I can put an end to the Sons of Prometheus. What else have they been up to around here? Let's go find out. I definitely want to go do that. <laughs> Get rid of them. Interesting Judging stick. by the look of this place, <laughs> it's important to the loyalist to knock. But the rebels don't seem to like it much. Are that surprised? Oops, I didn't mean to fall off. Let me back in. <laughs> I saw stuff. Oh. Oh, we're going back to this. Oh, okay. I was confused because. A map. Where is it? If I'm looking at this right, all roads leading into the jungle go through this village. Capturing this place is good strategy on the rebels' part. But I think there's more to it than that. This village holds some. Special significance to the tribe. I think Regala was sending a message when she ordered her troops to take it. Mm hmm. That sounds like trouble. I better see what's going on. Is there more of them out here? Oh, it's the one girl. Trying to take back the village. Ah! Give him a hand. <laughs> <laughs> it's so satisfying. You came. I did. Glad to see I could be useful. <laughs> I mean, actually annihilate all of them. Where are you? There you are. <laughs> Aloy, you came after all. Good talk. You have impeccable timing. First, you helped us ambush these scabs out in the wilds. Now, you've helped us liberate our village. For that, we owe you our thanks. Fenrise is a sacred place to my clan. Here, we train for the trials that make us into full-fledged soldiers. And here, we are marked as such when the trials are won. It is where Hikaru himself became a soldier. So taking this place was a show of strength by Regala. A failed one, thanks to you. 
We'll return it to its former glory and defend it from any rebels in the area. Sounds like you can take care of things from here then. I'll get going. I hope we meet again. Well, I'm glad I got it for you. What I give for a cool breeze. We can go up to the Banu Glands. I know how much you love them. They want money. Shh. She'll be back. Rest now. Keep an eye on her. Is she sick? <laughs> it's Aloy, isn't it? Walk with me. I am Ateka, commander of the Lowland clan. The girl, Zella, was poisoned by the blood choke. For months, it has polluted our waters, depriving mm. us of food and clean drink. We've learned to live with it as best we can. But recently, without explanation, the filth cleared from much of the lowland. Yet one river still runs red, like a split vein from a rotted corpse. So the water here is still poisoned? Exactly. I sent my best squad to find its source, led by Zala's mother. <sighs> They've failed to report back. Mm. Akaro told me how you dropped part of the throne on Regala at the Cool Root. Saved his life. So lend me your strength. Together we can find my squad and the source of the poison. Sounds like you know Hikaro pretty well. He was my commander before he was my chief. Mm. I had served in his squad since we were bare armed youths. Back then. He was a merciless warlord, determined to destroy any enemy of the Lowland clan. I was with him the day he took the grove, stood guard outside as he claimed the throne within. He entered a conqueror, but returned with the ambition of ending the constant bloodshed between the clans. Because you saw Faraday's message? Yes. That vision changed him, gave him new purpose. He became our first chief, ruler of all Tanakhth, and dedicated the tribe to fighting machines instead of each other. If you're so close with Hikaru, why aren't you a marshal? I wanted to serve as one, but Hikaru needed someone he could trust to lead his former clan. Maintaining control of the desert and sky clans is <laughs> difficult enough for him. But the title wasn't handed to me. I fought for the honor, as our rights demand. Five days of scars and blood. By the last sunset, I stood alone. The new commander. Close to 20 years have passed since. Oh, wow. This blood choke. Is that what you call the red algae? Yes. A couple years ago, it was only a thin streak of red in the river. It grew over time until it was a constant poison. It mm. sickens those who drink the polluted water, kill the fish we used to catch. But a while ago, unexplainably, the rivers began to clear, all except for one. Because of it, my people continue to waste away, weakening the clan. I'll help you find your missing squad. Good. I'm heading out now. The longer the blood choke remains, the longer my people suffer. We'll follow the Red River. The squad would have done the same. Might be able to pick up some sign of them. You ready? I am. Let's, Let's go. Let's head out. <laughs> Together. We'll start at the mouth of the Red River. This way. For months, I've watched as the strongest on? warrior and the mm -hmm. smallest child alike fell ill from the blood choke. When the other rivers cleared, it seemed like the tide had finally turned. You see those hopes dashed? Hey, we'll get to the bottom of this. We must. There's the mouth of the river. Hmm. We follow it upstream, we find the source of the poison. And hopefully, the squad. 
I'll follow your lead. Goes this way. Hmm. The machine was taken down recently. Whoever brought down this machine was precise. Must have been the missing squad. They struck true as the ten. Those machines couldn't have been brought down easily. And there's blood. There's so many of them, too. Jesus. It sounds like fighting. What? The squad could be in trouble. To knock soldiers. That's the squad. We have to bring those machines down. Backups arrived! Damn it. Yeah, they move so fast. I find it so hard to keep track of these ones. Why did it go after me? <laughs> She's attacking it, not me. So good. Oh, Gotta keep up the. Throwing a tantrum, it's just <laughs> throwing shit at us. Look at it. <laughs> so angry. Bam. Oh, it's still alive. God, sometimes it just looks like- yeah, it looked like it died before. Squad, gather around. Aloy, good fighting. Hateka, these weren't ordinary machines. They were overridden by rebels. Regala. Another poison to contend with. How did this start? We fought our way up the river to here. And then... We found that. We advanced to investigate. We had just started the climb when these machines attacked. Seemed like they were on patrol. A pile of dead machines, a poison river, and Regal's rebels. Mm-hmm. That can't be a coincidence. I agree. Rest. And then head back to Thornmarsh. Little Zella is waiting for you. Aloy and I will take it from here. Yes, Commander. If there are rebels up there, it could be a trap. We'll fight our way through regardless. You with me? Mm -hmm. Let's find a way up. Okay. On your lead, Aloy. Damn filth! All over my hands. Just don't let go. Don't have to tell me twice. That's a lot of dead machines. Normally, fresh water would be gushing over the edge. Now it's just poison. <laughs> My spies now. I'm okay. Yeah, it's just not gonna let me go up there. Yeah. Hear that? That sounds like a machine. Sounds like a big machine. It's shaking the ground. What a thunder jaw. Wait! We're exposed here. It hasn't seen us. Come on, go away. Is that a fire club? Okay. 
I think we're clear. We're gonna have to fight that thing, aren't we? Some kind of rebel camp. So many mm. machines. Butchers would do a lot of damage. There's fresh water coming from those falls. That dam must be blocking it. We'll have to take out the rebels first before we can deal with it. Two against many. Look All for the soldiers. lowland. Keep an eye out for machines or lowlanders. <laughs> So then I can fight that fire claw without them shooting bath. at me. You could and use a bat. Uh, 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 Let the lowlanders come. He's still, will burn them all. He's still He's talking. <laughs> Done. Till none are left standing. I wish I could do that. I'm hitting that. Stupid home. There we go. Who are you? I thought we killed everyone. I could have sworn I killed everyone. I don't know who the hell you are, but... Almost got him with that. Almost got him. Oh. You just go one from one attack to another without any hesitation. Oh. <laughs> oh, got him. That's the last one. <laughs> what were the rebels doing here? Let's find out. Have a look around. I thought I saw something over by the dam. I'll go check it out. Ooh. It's machine lore. It's a machine lore. Well, that explains all these machines. Uh, Why put it here? My focus might show me more. Hmm. Machine scrap and broken corruptor components used for overrides. Mm. Were the rebels testing them here? So all these dead machines are what? Failures? Maybe. Interesting. The rebels had a large operation here. There has to be something else that'll tell us what was going on. I thought I saw some equipment over by the falls. Don't think I can follow you there. <laughs> it's a message <laughs> from one of the sons of Prometheus. It says the rebels were about to leave, but decided to guard the dam after the water started to clear. Wow. We saw an opportunity and seized it. Dunda, I'm leaving this note in case we don't cross paths on the road. I'm heading back to the base. We finished the boss's test early, gave the order to break down camp, but the Tanakh, but these Tanakh insisted they were staying. Say they have a new mission. Two days back, the water suddenly started running clear. Don't know why or how. 
The dam's the only thing keeping the red gunk flowing in the river below, all the way to the enemy's capital. Told the Tanakh that they can keep their gear, the gear, I wasn't about to haul it all down the mountain myself, and if they're dead, set on the guarding the dam, the dam is from scavengers, they'll need it. Consider this mission accomplished and report back to base immediately. Keep the forge fires strong. Practice. Interesting. I'm gonna be interested to see after we talk to Aaron and figure it out what he's figured out and then tell him what we found out. When a hit from this thing could do a lot of damage. There's one of these at the grove in the arena to put down machines. I think I know what happened. The rebels were luring machines here so they could override them. But they couldn't get them all. So they killed some with the ballista, forming the dam. Once they realized it was blocking clean water from flushing away the blood choke, they decided to stay and protect it. Spineless cowards! Poisoning us until we waste away? How am I gonna- The dam. Can you break it? With this? I'll take a look. Okay, I'll wait here. I should scan the dam. Might show me a weak point. I don't know if I need to scan. Okay, maybe I do. There's an explosive sack from a machine inside the dam. One hit could blow the whole thing up. I just need to find a way to expose it. Oh shit. I might be able to pull part of the dam open. Expose the sack. I see. Really? I canceled that <laughs> when I fell into the water. Mm, this is a great view. There's the sack. It's gonna take a powerful shot to blow it up. And I can't do both at once. The ballista. Ateka, can you fire a bolt from the ballista while I hold this thing open? I'm on it. Great view happening for us. 10 out of 10. Let's hope this works. Hope this works. Hold it! <laughs> oh, moving. <laughs> I had the worst angle on that. Oh, God. Nice flying. Ha ha. <laughs> it is pretty fun. <laughs> we did it. Nice. Ateka? It's gone. After all this time, we're finally free of the poisoned waters. Thank you, Aloy. I must return to Thorn Marsh. Meet me there when you can. You deserve a proper reward. Oh, I'll be there right away. There's Thornmarsh. The rebels must have been spying on them. Could be a nice glide down. Look how pretty it is here. <sighs> Looks like the water's cleared up around here. I should find a Tekka. Anyone up for a game of machine? Definitely not. You could barely tell where one ended and then... Aloy, I was just recounting your deeds at the dam. Our deeds. <laughs> we did it together. True enough. Look around. Thornmarsh is free of the blood choke. We don't have to live in fear of the poison. It feels like for the first time in months, 
We can wash our wounds with clean water. And how are you feeling, Zella? <laughs> Ready to hunt. <laughs> Not yet, little warrior. <laughs> no. I promised you a reward equal to your deeds. I cannot think of anything more fitting than this. Ooh. Thank you. What is it? Wherever your travels take you, Aloy. May you always fly on the wings of the ten. <laughs> Nice. Tanakh the Reaver. Ooh. <laughs> Let me look at that. Where is it? Oh, damn. I was saying how much I wanted an outfit that looked like this. Crazy. Hell yeah. The hat looks good. <laughs> New outfit. <laughs> Quiet. Oh, they're looking for me. Those must be the Osram I heard about at the campfire. It looks like they're in trouble. Hey, whoever you are, we need help over here. I'm here to help. Are you okay? Get up! Oh. There we go. More? Thanks for helping, Huntress. There we go. Why me? Shoot someone else. <laughs> With me, I don't even know where this one went. Job, guys. Whew. Okay. Freebooter. It's been six years since I shaved my head and joined the Freebooters to follow Ursa's example. Enough with the eldermen of the claim and servitude through marriage. Enough with the mercenary companies that wouldn't let women join. And enough with the mad sun king, the biggest oppressor of them all. I'd rather lose my life than continue living as someone else. That's why I don't understand why so many freebooters join the vanguard. Of course, I see that Avad's reign is the opposite of his father's, but I was in it for independence, not, a, not allegiance. But hey, to each their own. That's the very definition of freedom, right? Now I'm working security for a salvage operation. Pay's not great, and that Karuf guy is a pile of dung, but I'm happy. I'm seeing the Forbidden West with my own eyes, even get to smash something with my hammer every once in a while. Best of all, I can walk away anytime I want. I wonder who this is. Hey. Oh, there's hey, another one. Mind picking up the mine launchers? Uh, not really. <laughs> An unsent letter written in a clumsy glyphs. It is hard to write this letter. I know it's been hard to read. Verna fell to machine today. She lived a time after the attack. She did not survive the time it took to return to camp. I'm sending you her armor, her weapons, and her belongings. I'm also sending the shards from the salvage that would have been hers. She spoke about home. She said she wasn't a seen. She said she wasn't seen as a fighter. She said if she died, people would say she had wasted her life in salvage, when she could have lived in marriage. I fought by Fer Ferna. She battled with the strength of any in the camp. No argument on night duty. She had the brains to move our spoils pits outside the camp to stop the stench. We are weaker without her. We lost a hunter and a friend. She never lost her dream. She might have fallen, but she fell in a place she wanted to be. Surely that's a sign that she knew how to live. I will send more shards to the next three shares. Her name will burn in us until the day we fall. From those stalkers for me. Aww. Oh, I guess. Oh. I think 
think this is the last of the mine launchers. <laughs> Making me do work before I even talk to you? <laughs> Come on. So, red hair? Kills machines like I down ale? <laughs> I'd say luck just brought us the savior of Meridian. Just Aloy. You mind telling me why you're hunting stalkers in the middle of Tanakh's territory? Oh, not hunting. Salvaging. I can explain. Later. The stalkers we killed aren't the only ones around. This jungle's crawling with them. They're nasty. And they don't give up. We thought we could use their mines to secure the camp. But we have nowhere near enough. You're a hunter. You could get rid of the stalkers and get me their mine launchers at the same time. I'll make sure you get payment for it. Hastily written, but uh, this contract has everything you need to know on it. Got it. This outfit looks good. <laughs> future me is back. I know, there's like a lot of future me's in these episodes. It just happens because they're really long recordings that I'm just cutting down a lot. <laughs> so, Ever a dull day, yes, honey. but we're back. Huntress. Oh, I, I don't want anything. <laughs> Take care. Why would you call me, huh? You don't have anything. I gotta go do your thing. Let's go get this black box, too. Oh, there's another flower here. I shall grab this. And... Oh, there's also a thing over there. Oh, that's where the black box is. Wait, is this just for the side, or did it do that side, too? Wasn't paying attention to that side. <laughs> the locator shows there's another recording in there. I need a power cell. Great. Ah, I see it. I didn't notice I'm on the ground here. <laughs> it was too dark. Machines. That was the problem. Yep. There must be another flight recorder transmitting a signal. Maybe I can track it down. Does that mean that she knows where it is? Maybe. There's a tide ripper over there. Great. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> this is cute. How adorable. Oh, that's cute. Interesting. Talk to Ariva. I like what you guys have. It's nice. One of Hikaru's marshals. With a wounded hunter. Maybe they need help. Oh, the matter. <laughs> Easy. You saw what happened as clearly as I did. How did this happen? Overconfidence. I'm Marshal Levera. Kanala here and two others ventured into the Valley of the Fallen just beyond these cliffs even though it's off-limits. The chief sent me to recover them and investigate the strange reports from the valley. What do you mm. mean? And where are the other two? They, they didn't make it. I had I to fight off them. several machines just to get Kanala out. The valley was closed months ago for good reason. Machines have gathered in number as if they're drawn there by something. Not to mention the strange glowing lights off the coast. The valley is cursed. We never should have gone in. Hmm. Interesting. Ivira, you were one of the challengers at the Cool Route. The one who fired the ballista at the Slitherfang. And you're the champion oh. who defeated it, saved the chief's life, revealed the truth of the visions. I was just doing what I could to help her. You made quite an impression that day, and despite the carnage, it was the best day of my life. I became a marshal, 
bore witness to the vision of unity. You said there are strange lights off the coast. From an island to the south. They appeared one day out of the blue around the same time the machines moved into the valley. There have also been reports of a streak of light that rises and falls in the sky above the island. I saw it on the fourth night. A flame that climbed in the sky until it disappeared among the stars. It was not the northern lights to the island. I highly no. doubt it. <laughs> the currents between but that's the what they're trying to sound like. Strong. You drown for sure. Oh, it's on an island. I wonder if this has something to do with the zeniths. Maybe. Don't know what any Probably of that's about, but maybe. I'm like we're too low to see those, unless something's changed. <laughs> if the valley's been off limits for months, why did you go in? We wanted to run the trial. The valley is a great test for lowland soldiers. Survive for ten days and nights. Take down any machine that stands in the way. Dax had a plan. We'd hunt down each machine one by one until we cleared the valley, earned the clan's respect. But we got separated from Yveka after the third day. Then machines cut us off from the way out. By the time Marshal Avira found us, we were wounded and out of supplies. More machines attacked us as we made our escape. Dax was right behind us, but he couldn't run fast enough. Hmm. A lot of machines in one place. Sounds bad. I better look into it. See if I can put a stop to it. Then I'll come with you. Fight by your side. No. Better let me take a look first. Trust me, it's for the best. I guess if you insist. Once you're in the valley, head for the Great Falls and the cliff south of the Metal Devil. The machines seem attracted to those sites. Mm -hmm. Got it. Thanks. Let's go see what we'll these rest here a while more strange then lights head for are. the medic in Falls Edge. Strike true as the ten, Aloy. Time to go. Um, which way? Am I not? Oh, yeah, I am. Okay. Ah, it's all here. Something's attracting machines out of the valley. Sounds like some kind of lure. Probably Regala again. Stupid Regala. I just want to smack her in the face. My fear. Keep this green shine for later. Am I going that way? Yep, I guess I am. Bam. Grab. Jump. Boink. Okay. Better follow the trail. Slide. I hope this bridge holds up. Don't jinx it. Long way to fall. Really? I guess it is. Then we jump up here. She was just hanging for a moment. I gotta climb up higher. This really is a trial. <laughs> you should be good at these. Aren't you having fun? Oh. <sighs> Okay. Now to find the waterfall and the cliff south of the horse. Yes. Have you ever mentioned so. deadly machines were gathering near there? Yes. We finally made it in. Thank God. So hope these the aren't options. Bad one too. Make sure all my arrow. Yep. <laughs> Make sure all my arrows machine. are made. Damn. Took a lot of hits to bring this one down. Better be ready for anything. Oh, I'm ready. Another one. Dead to knock. They were. That must be Dax. Oh, right there. Hmm. Died fighting the machine. <sighs> what a waste. Aw, don't say that. <laughs> it's heartbreaking. Mm, it is sad, though. Growing lights. We shouldn't have gone. This must be the Zenith base. 
glowing lights. Looks like they have a shield around the entire place. Of course, they'd make their base on their own private island. But back to the current problem. I've got to check out the areas of Vera mentioned. There's oh, there. Oh. Of that Horus on the ridge. I didn't even see that. Whoa. It is theirs. They would have a... Interesting. Okay, so we know where they're hanging out. So that's what this island is, huh? I'm guessing. Maybe let me look back that way. Maybe over here? Maybe that's why this is all blocked out still. That's interesting. <laughs> Ooh. There's the waterfall and killing oh. machines as promised. You saw if I'm right, where are you? There should be a lure around here. Thirty. I'm able to find it with my focus. I'm scared. Is that it? No. That's a pigeon. <laughs> You don't know I'm here. Damn it. Come on. No butt shots for me. Oh, hi, chicken. How you doing? I hope you're doing well. I'm just going to move your face really quick. Hope you don't mind. But your face is still there. Well, now you're dead. <laughs> there. there is clear. Oh, I think I needed a Scorcher scanning ear. Let's see something. if there's a lure around here. I don't remember exactly what I needed it for, but I know that I needed it. So I'm glad that I got that one. Let's see. Where is this more then? Is it that up there? What is that? The machine lure. That's what I thought. Perfect. But this one looks advanced. Yeah, I was gonna say, it looks like something. Maybe they're keeping it here to keep them away from the island so that people just don't come wandering around. Okay. Look at this thing. Let's see if I can turn wow. this thing off. Yeah, definitely. There's data here. Looks like a log. And something called. Brought to you by Julius. Directives received. Unchanged. Keep on chugging. Local vermin exterminated at this node to date. Seven. Yay. Uh-oh. Intrusion detected. Yikes. I'm losing control of this node. That's not good. Rerouting to Bravo node. Have a good day. Alpha node. With Julius? Some Zenith AI? Interest. Local vermin exterminated. Was it attracting machines to kill intruders here? Yep, that's what I guessed. Yeah. This lure shut down now. Yeah, fuck that lure. The cliff, south of the horse. There might be another lure there. Yeah, and then we can probably get a better look at this place too. Oh, would you look at that? Looks like Is that a thunderjaw. Okay, I think I'm in the area Ibira mentioned. There's definitely deadly machines here. Yep. If there's a lure nearby, my focus can help me find it. Who freeze that machine? Who freeze, you say? Don't come over here. <laughs> I didn't notice he was right there. <laughs> Go away. I don't want to be your friend. I'm sorry, Mr. Thunderjaw. Oh, yeah. No, go away.
Oh. Aw, you little shit. How do you know? I mean to do that, but I mean. Oh. No! <laughs> I'm really just trying to knock these off. Leave me alone, Mr. Thunderjaw. Maybe later. Stop missing! No, he died. Damn it! Oh, you have low health too. Nice. <sighs> Stop moving. Oh. I knew it. I did not have. To oh, okay. Did we need the double hit? Infinite. <laughs> He just don't stop, did he? to see right now. We did it. <laughs> Good job, Aloy. <laughs> oh my god, that was terrifying. Another lore. Yep. Gotta deal with it. Alright. Gotta shut this, this thing says. down. I wonder if this intelligent AI is like that thing uh, that we read Another before from past Julius. silver or something. This one mentions a third lore close by. I better check. Hmm. Fiddlesticks, I'm losing control of this node. Rerouting to Charlie node. Catch you later. Yowza. <laughs> Get out. What the hell? Oh, God, right. <laughs> the Zenus left these things here to draw in machines and protect yep. the approach to their base. I mean, that was my guess. It just seemed very tactical. Hey, I was over there before. I already see it. Looks like they're protecting it in a circle. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Where's the lure? I have to take out these machines before I can shut it off. Okay, well, we're just gonna go like this and then like. I just love how absolutely confused all the other machines are. <laughs> Watcher's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Everyone keeps dying. This is absolute overkill. <laughs> I didn't need to do that. <laughs> First I have to take out the machines. Then I can override the lore. Wait. Not everyone's dead? Who's still left? His oh, there's a watcher right here. Time to overkill you, too. <laughs> Got the stamina, might as well use it, right? 
should be able to override the lore now. Yep. Do you hear that? I hear people talking. They override it first. Let's see. Gotcha. That should be the last one. Let's see what it says. <sighs> Original message from benefactors attached. Good talk, local vermin exterminated at this node. The day four. Let's step it up. Uh-oh. Intrusion detected. I'm losing control of this node. What a bummer. No nodes to reroute. Self-termination sequence engaged. To my benefactors, it was a truly a pleasure to serve you. Sincerely, your favorite software-based minimal intelligence protocol. Proto pro prototype, probably. <laughs> Mission terminated. So it, it wasn't a smart AI, I guess. Looks like there's a recording here. Hey, shithead. I got a task for you. The Julius is ready to serve. Shut up and do what you're told. Use the indigenous robots to keep this place clear of local vermin. I'll do it myself, but Gerard says I have to stay focused. So have some fun for the both of us, huh? We'll do, benefactor visitor. You can count on the Julius. So Eric left a simple AI in charge of the wars. Looks like it shut itself down when I overrode the last one. Oh, but they got alerted for it. See if they're okay. Yeah, where are they? Oh, nice oh, hiding spot. Nox. This is cute. Please. What's an outlander doing all the way out here? Clearing the valley? You must be one of the missing Tanox. Mm. Everyone thought you were dead. Nearly. Dax and Kanala. Are they Kanala's alive. Marshal Evira pulled her out. Speaking of... Aloy! Ivira, Couldn't stay away, could you? <laughs> and miss my chance to hunt the champion in the Valley of the Fallen? Never! And I see you found Eva Oh no. That and one did feel too like easy fight. compared to the last one. You with me, Marshal? Oh, yep, they would send these. My blade is yours! Blood of the Ten! We get to kill these things? What are they? They look so kind of cute, though. Like, I, I can't not say that. I'm not leaving, don't worry. She's moving back. Down. There's this other one. Where is it? I'm so confused. Oh, it's just hiding over here. What are you doing over here? Oh! Ow! Okay. Pretty crazy. Where'd it go? Stay over here. Okay. Watch this fire! Sure with the pen. Now they move so fast. Sorry to keep track. She had aggro of it. Aloy, we can't rest until these things are dead. Ah, oh, that's the worst. I only get like a couple shots off, and then it hits me out of the attack. But I'm already starting. My least favorite. What is what is going on? There's something hit me from the other side. <laughs> My plate is yours, Aloy. We did it! That Good was job. Amazing. That was I'll weird. <laughs> I think I took care of all the lures. 
I should let Avira know. I'll be right back. <laughs> I just interrupted she needs right. a medic, but she'll live. <laughs> Thanks to you. Gotta say, every time we meet is the best day ever for fighting. No. That battle was something else. And those weird machines. Do you think there'll be more? No. I figured out what was causing the machines to gather in the valley. And put a stop to it. Oh. Good news for the clan, then. You don't want to fight more of those things, Avira. They're not like other machines. The masters they answer to see people as... Inconveniences. They'd kill anyone without a second thought. And eventually I'll have to deal with them. The light's offshore. Is that from them? Yeah. It's a kind of shield to protect the island. The machines drawn to this valley were meant to kill anyone who got close. Meaningless slaughter. Mm hmm But definitely something for a champion, not a marshal. Here, take this then. It might help with what lies ahead. Thank you. The valley should be safe enough for a while. But you have to tell the rest of the Tanakh to stay as far away from that island as possible. Mm -hmm. By that the champion's sure. word. I hope our paths cross again, Aloy. No. And they keep calling them vermin like this is so... God, I just want to fucking end him. They've been alive too long anyways. Let's go get these mine launchers that I was supposed to do so long ago. <laughs> but then, you know... I'm glad I did that other mission. That was so interesting to see their base. I didn't even know they had a base. The stalkers Makes that sense, wanted me to get rid of. They should be nearby. Might want to take a look at the contract. Make sure I'm not forgetting anything. Don't think I can override nice you. Guess the The mine launcher. Hey, where's the mine launcher? Great. Let me look at what, what it is on stalkers, because I don't remember. Oh. Oh, the mine launcher is on their butt. Okay. It's the little butt cheeks. I shot up a mine launcher. Flipped a mine launcher. How many did I need? Oh, only three? That's actually not bad. That's but I need to clip the mine launchers before I kill the mine launcher. No. I have enough mine launchers to set up a perimeter back at that Osram camp. Nice. I should take these back as soon as I can. Might as well grab the extra ones over here. That one well. Me some good news. I got good news. I got the mine launchers, and those stalkers shouldn't be a problem anymore. Thanks. You should help us defend our camp. Here's your payment. I'm Denur, by the way. Sorry if I was a bit short before. You had a lot on your plate. No. <laughs> so you're salvagers. Are you part of Carif's crew? Yes, actually. And you're getting parts to forge him some armor out here? <laughs> Our leader, She's Warren, like, was obsessed with the Forbidden West. Collected every story he could find about it. And he was convinced that what he needed to make the armor is in this jungle. He wasn't worried about the Tanakh? Or machines? He thought we could stay out of their way. But a few days ago, we ran into a Thunderjaw. Where? Warren managed to lure it away from the camp. But we haven't seen him since. Oh, God. Now he's gone and... We don't even have the plans for his armor. They're in his trunk, and it's locked. Hmm. Maybe you could track him down. Even if all you can find is his remains, the key to the trunk should be on him. 
No. <laughs> I can look into it. You just take care of your people right now. Will do. Hopefully he's not dead. Here. All you need to know is in this contract. Let's see. Hunter will track down the whereabouts of Warren Yellen Vanter. He's if he's found deceased, please retrieve the key in his possession. Okay. This is where Denora's contract said they ran into a thunderjaw. Before Warren lured it away. Oh. Let's see if my focus can pick up something. Yep, I think I caught his tracks. He's going this way. A lot of broken trees. Thunderjaw tore through the jungle chasing after one Osara. Jesus. <laughs> Must have really hated him. Warren had the right idea. Lowering the Thunderjaw in the opposite direction from his camp. Could have wiped out his entire crew. Warren really gave the Thunderjaw a chase. He couldn't have outrun it forever. Hmm. Oh? Crest of armor on its head. Must be a little nature. Shut. Okay, I gotta find that key for Denor. Better take a look at Warren's body. No, oh, but he got the thunder jaw. There's no key. That's oh, gotta be around here somewhere. No. Oh. Maybe my Is focus it... can spot it. Don't tell me it's inside the thunder jaw. Oh, it's not okay. Wait. Is this salmon boulder? Machine markings. They're too small for a thunder jaw. Do you take down the Thunderjaw and then get killed by something else? Warren must have clipped this from the Thunderjaw during the fight. Uh oh. I don't think I'm alone. Oh, please tell me this dispatcher's loaded. Clamber Jaws! Got those socks. Aloy? Now would be the time to shoot! What? Oh, it's on the wrong one. I was like, what is going on? Actually, I needed their tail. Oh, what the fuck? I forget they have that attack. It's like the only enemy in the game that I can think of that has like a grab attack and it's so scary. Worth it. <laughs> I needed that. Where to go? Oh. They move so fast that I can never keep track of them. Oh shit, that was on that. <laughs> I had at one shot. Okay, let's see if I can get this tail too. I mean, I don't need the tail, so never mind. Oh. Damn it! <laughs> I thought I was able to <laughs> talk to that. God, they move so fast. This has to be like one of the fastest enemies for sure. Like, look at that. It's just completely the opposite direction. <laughs> In an instant. Hmm. It's crazy. I think there's more than a salvage they can find. Maybe they took Warren's key. I should climb the waterfall. See if they left anything behind. Anything up here? Oh, what's this? What are these walls? Is this a cauldron? Oh my god. This is a creepy cauldron. <laughs> I don't want to be near here. <laughs> No more. I'm terrified. 
whoa. It is a cauldron. Wait, where am I? Oh, I am down here. Oh, it's a secret cauldron. But we're not here for this. I'll be back to do this cauldron. A scrap pile. Let's see if I can find this key now. Mm. Oh, there it is. One key ready to be delivered. Eh, true. There she is. What happened? <laughs> that was so weird. I found Warren's key. So he really is dead. Mm. He was a good man. At least he saved everyone here. And he took down the thunder dog. Let's hope this key shows us how to honor his memory. It's a map with salvage sites marked on it. I was right. He wanted us to finish what he started, to finish the armor. But the crew is still injured and tired. I can't ask them to do this, Aloy. Do you think you have time for a few more contracts? I think I do. Give them what all. do you need me to do? Where and marked a beach we scouted before setting up camp. I think I know what he was looking for. Behemoths. Great. And the spike snouts that strengthen them. Also Reinforced great. behemoth parts should make our armor tough as nails. I'll give it a go then. Lay it on me. Warren marked an inlet on this map. By the looks of it, he was looking for something underwater. Hmm. I need you to find out what he might have been searching for there and bring it back here. That's interesting. I'll see if I can take a look. I should get going. Good luck. Let's go see. Suggest damaging the behemoth, behemoth before allowing the spike snouts to strengthen them. Or killing the spike snouts. That sounds like a better idea. <laughs> Once the said machine is strengthened, the reinforcement effect won't last for long. So be ready to strike. So am I just killing them? Oh, I have to let them. Oh, okay. That's interesting. So I have to let them reinforce them. Okay. Oh, I think we found them. But look what else it says is here. <laughs> I'm a little scared to go down there. I don't know how I feel about it. Guess we'll find out soon. The beach Denor told me about should be nearby. Might want to read Look at it. Oh my god, you could see its him. eyes. It's just looking over here. A behemoth. Just like Denor said. I need to take it down while it's boosted by those spike snouts around it. But I might want to do some damage to it beforehand. Make this fight easier. Now how... How do they reinforce it? That's the real part of them I got. Let's see. Could try using acid ammo. I should do some damage to that behemoth. And get the spike snouts to strengthen it. Oh shit, I thought I killed it. I was they like boosted the behemoth. Now's the time to take it down. I did it. Nice. Just need to salvage those parts for Denor. I'm just gonna yoink them and be on my way. There Bye, guys. We go. Ah. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> I tried swimming in the ocean before, and there's a huge current that pushed me. This looks creepy. <laughs> Little moonfish everywhere. Oh, you see that? It's definitely something over there. Oh, now I'm curious. I should make more ammo while they're swimming.
Oh god, there's a lot of enemies. Great. The one thing I can't do, fight in the water. <laughs> Which is why I hate being in the water. Okay, come on. This should work. We don't got time. Come on, hurry. Are you scared? I don't want to be here. <laughs> Hopefully I won't be alerted by this noise. I think the Nora will want this. Are you just sleeping down there? What are you doing down there? Ah, oh, they're everywhere. There's probably a fire gleam somewhere. Or a crack. That's like the tiniest crack ever. Oh my god. That's terrifying. Grab it and go. Is there a way to get out this way? No. Good thing that message popped up pretty high up, or else I wouldn't have even noticed. Oh, I just yoinked that through the floor. <laughs> I should take them nice. Back. We could use a hand over here. Come here. Show them what you Let's see how these guys hold up against the savior of Meridian. Time to put steel to Anvil. I'm getting beat up. Like, look at that! It's it looks ridiculous from my point of view when watching it happen to someone else. <laughs> it just looks so funny. Yeah, shoot him in the butt. Everyone okay? Hey, Lord, over here. Are they all like super tough ones too? Talk about timing. <laughs> Those Tanakhs showed up from nowhere. I appreciate the assist. God, I could help. And I got those behemoth parts. Plus, I found what Werend was looking for in the water. Somehow, he knew there were ancient ruins there. I salvaged what I could. They said he studied ah, the area, so... he loved paid off. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Too bad he never got to see the ruins. So, time to make that armor. I'm All moving right. on a lot of different armor. <laughs> Something wrong? I found a message from Werend on the back side of the map. It just said, take care of them, Denor. Take care of them. The man who always had a plan left me in charge of our crew. And that's bad? I barely know what I'm doing half the time. What was he thinking? Aww. From where I'm standing, you've been doing a pretty good job looking out for no. I guess we have been able to hold our own. And now I'll make sure we win those shards for our efforts, too. Man, I, I want them all to win. make it back to Baron Light, you should stop by our main camp. Oh, I'm going back there I'll right probably now. probably have this armor ready by then. <laughs> you could come see us win Karuf's prize. Who's gonna win? Maybe I will. Oh. <laughs> I see the nurse taking his new job pretty seriously. Aww. Wait, do you have anything? <laughs> you need parts? Maybe. I got them. You wanna sell? Wait, do you have a... I'll take them. A workbench that I could use? Before My wares are here if you need them. Damn, you are just radiating joy. <laughs> Talk to Karuf. I'm so interested to see. Let's go do it. Let's see. Uh, I gotta say, these are some good pieces. Each set has great parts, but overall, none of them scream best in the West, you know? Maybe they should but all work not together. To worry, I might be able to pull in some favors. Sell these sets instead. What about the prize? Well, no one really brought what I asked for, so I'll just keep that and get going. 
What? You've got to be kidding me. This is unacceptable. I agree. After all the work we did? Not so fast, Karif. You said each set had great parts. So make a set that combines them. She's right. It'd make the perfect defense against the Forbidden West. That's what I'm saying. A creative and I wouldn't be able and to a choose. communal I feel bad. endeavor. I approve. And since everyone came up with part of it, they should all get the shards you promised. Mm-hmm. Fine. Mm -hmm. Then just forge the armor, give it to me, and I'll take it back east. And let you walk away with our best work? Mm -mm. No. Let the savior of Meridian have it. She'll test it out properly. Best armor in the Forbidden West. Tested by the savior of Meridian herself. Not a bad selling point. Okay, you all got yourselves a deal. I'll go get things ready with my business contacts then. Hmm. You do that. <laughs> that smile she gave. <laughs> you do that. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. This won't take long. I won't. This armor ought to be worthy of the greatest hunter in the Forbidden West. I mean, West. I'll pay for Thank it. You. it so, helps. what now? That little spot we found in the desert kind of grew on me. Wouldn't mind sticking around. Uh, there's still plenty of salvage to be done out here. Looks like we're all staying in the West. I guess I'll be seeing you around then. Thanks <laughs> again for the armor. You all put a lot into it. Mm-hmm. And I'm keeping it. Using those behemoth parts for the armor. Asaram awesome, art. Nice. Let's go look at it. Where is it? Damn, you know, it actually looks pretty good. It's got a little flair to it. Yeah, it's definitely a melee one, you can tell. Would have never thought I of might that. wear it once in a while. Right now, I'm, I just got this outfit, so I'm going to be wearing this one for at least a little while longer. <laughs> that is for sure. Is 50 the max level that you can be in this game? I think it is. I don't think I'm getting XP anymore. How can you say that? I only meant... No! I have to find him. What's going on here? You're her. The one from the embassy. Please. You have to go after my father. He's going to get himself killed in the stand of the Sentinels. The forest beyond the village. Everyone else seems to have forgotten that we don't abandon our own. Fenira? If you're gonna drag the Outlander into this, at least tell her the whole story. Garoka gave her that stab wound. It was an accident. Hmm. How did your father accidentally stab you? For a while now, he's been sneaking out of the village to hunt alone in the stand. Sometimes he's gone for days. So this time, I followed him to his hunting camp, tried to convince him to come home. Words led to fists, and somewhere in the middle of it all, his knife. Oh my god. He was already gone when I fell. You would have bled to death had I not come looking for you. Oh my god. It doesn't make any sense. Your own father. The way he looked at me. It was like I was a stranger. Perhaps it's time to recognize... He's fine! He has to be. I can't make any promises, but I'll find him if I can. At least to see if he's alright. Where's his hunting camp? Southeast of here. Thank you. Glad that's settled. Now you need to rest. I'm going right away. That is... Wait, where is it? Oh, it's over there. Imagine getting stabbed by your own 
Pet father. That would be awful. I'd want to think he was possessed too. <laughs> That's for sure. What are you guys doing here? Not gonna do much harm with purge water ammo. I wasn't planning on it. They look kind of cute. I just feel bad killing them. They they poop out flowers. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why would I want to kill them? I feel bad. Venera said her father's hunting camp should be near here. Yeah. Oh, here it is. Sounds like there's a machine. The hunting camp. This must be where Venera confronted her father. I might be able to pick up his trail with my focus. Uh, supplies for traps. Groga must have been preparing for a hunt. Mm. This is a lot of blood for one wound. Venera was mm. lucky she didn't bleed out. Can I look at this or no? It won't let me look at it. <laughs> I can't investigate it. A jar of oil knocked okay. over. I guess I'm not. Maybe when Garoka and Fenira were fighting. Examine. Some of the oil might have gotten on Garoka. Looks like there's a trail I can follow. Let's see where this leads. That was the first time that I didn't have me examine it and actually scan it. Usually I try to scan it and I'm like, oh shit, I need to examine it instead. <laughs> That was the first time it was the opposite. A claw strider. And a lot of traps. I must be Garoka. I better help him. Now, well, let's see what you got. I heard you shot your daughter. I think I got some questions. Thanks for the assist, Huntress. Come. Let's speak. Oh, don't run into your traps. <laughs> Else I'm gonna end up like your daughter. You fight like you're a Tanakh, but you're not one of us. State your name, Outlander. I'm wearing your I'm outfit, though. <laughs> you must be Garoka. Venera. Asked me to find you. She's back in the village. She's recovering from a wound from your fight. Then she's in good hands. Come, we have to get moving. There's a squad deeper in the forest. They're about to walk into an ambush. By who? Rebels? That's what you want to call them. Spineless scabs. All Wait. the same, I could use your spear. What do you say? Fine. Where is the squad? I would like to know this why way. you stabbed your child. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> You're gonna take me into one of your traps on accident. You're gonna run into here. How did you not hit your trap? <laughs> that would have been funny. We'll make faster time if we cut through the Sentinels. How do you know about the attack? We've been watching enemy movements in the mountain pass. They've been trying to take our territory for years. This is just their latest attempt. Years? Rakala's rebellion isn't that old. Something's off here. Yeah. Ambush! Sky Clan has found us! What? Oh, he's in like... No! Not them! The stalkers! Oh, he just totally blocked my shot. <laughs> I think he's forgotten. Mm -mm. I was so sure they were. Never mind. We have to get to the squad. 
I have a feeling we're gonna get there. Roku's definitely be... not all there. Yeah. This isn't looking good. No. Oh, and then if he like found out, oh, if he found out he stabbed his. Oh, this was sad. Quiet now. We're almost there. Mm. J Squad, we're. What? No. An old memorial for fallen mm. soldiers. I think we're a lot more than too late. Garoka. Who are you, Outlander? How do you know my name? I'm Aloy. Fenira asked me to find you. I'm guessing you don't remember what happened. I went away again, didn't I? Why are we here? You told me there was a squad. I was about to be attacked. This is where it happened, isn't it? A long time ago. Yes. My squad. The Sky Clan ambushed us, slaughtered them all. It would have been. 30 years ago now. Fenira thinks you've been sneaking off into the forest to hunt. Or you've been coming back here. There's no easy way to say this, Skoroka. She's hurt bat she tried to stop you from leaving i heard her but i would never know everything is a fog i feel like i've been wandering through it lost my blade unfamiliar in my hand and when it finally clears i can't remember what i was doing or why i'm always just alone in the forest How long has it been like this? This fog? Weeks. Months, maybe. At first I thought it was a passing thing. Like forgetting after a knock on the head. Then names and faces became... difficult. And I started finding myself in the forest. Unsure how I got there. Why haven't you told Fenira? What was I supposed to say? That I'm unraveling? Like a frayed, weak rope? No! But look where that's gotten you. She has no idea why you hurt her. No. So the Sky Clan ambushed your squad a long time ago? We were almost through with our patrol. About to head back to the village when they swarmed us. I alone survived. When my wounds scarred, I returned here and built a memorial where my comrades fell. And then I struck down twice as many of their soldiers in retribution. Such were the clan wars. Earlier, you said the enemy had been trying to take the Lowland territory for years. I guess that was during the clan wars? Before Hikaru became our chief, our clans were constantly at war. We fought over every inch of this forest. The ruined village nearby is a remnant of those days. No matter how many soldiers fell, there was always another vendetta to pursue. They say that's why the wood of the Sentinels runs red. For the generations of blood spilled. We should head back to the village. Wait! The memorial. It's missing a piece there. A marker of metal. Made from the blades of my fallen comrades. Where is it? It has to be around here somewhere. I have to find it. I know it's... I know it's here. Hey, calm down. Let me take a look. Okay. No. <laughs> I should scan the memorial with my focus. Tracks. Leading away from the memorial. Lead the way. Kind of tracks though. What would have taken it? Clamber jaws. They might have scrapped the marker. 
filthy mm. scavengers. On your lead. Mr. Clamberjaw. <laughs> Keep this thing. <laughs> More Clamberjaws. Care about me, huh? Why is this one not moving? We fix it. This one's broken. <laughs> All but <the> back. <laughs> that noise. How to find the marker? Got the marker. Yep. Now to give this back to Goroka. Over here, Aloy. Did you find it? I did. Here. I think this is the missing marker. Yes, that's it. I'll return it to the memorial. You go on ahead. I want to spend some time to remember my comrades. Are you sure? I'll be fine. The fog is gone for now. All right. I'll have reliving to the that is so I know you're okay. So sad for Thank him. Thank you, Aloy. Well, at least I can tell Fenira why Garoka's been running off. Yeah. Back to Tide's Reach, then. <gasps> where's my father? <laughs> Aloy, you're back. But where's my father? It's okay. I found him. He's not deranged, Fenira. He's been forgetting things more and more. He thought he was still in the clan wars, that he could save his squad from an ambush. Mm. When we got to the memorial, he came back to the present. So it's like he's been lost in a fog. Wait. I've heard of something similar, a rare occurrence among chaplains. Their memory fades with the long years. Mm -hmm. Karuka's not a chaplain, but he is the age of one. Before Hikaru became chief, few of us would live to be so old. Yeah. So that's why. Oh, thank the Ten. If he was found to be insane, then by rights he'd be put to death. What? No, he's just getting old. He needs care, not a death sentence. Pretty sure the rest of the village sees that as one and the same. But we'll keep a close eye on him. Mm. Speaking of, where is he now? Here. Oh, little spear. I... I'm so sorry. It's all right, Father. You're home safe. <laughs> and I understand now. When the fog comes, I'll hold your hand tight and remember for you. You don't have to be afraid. Thank you for all your help. Please, accept this. Your deeds here, what you've done for Fenira, will always, always be remembered. Thank you, Aloy. Aloy? Yes, Aloy. No. No. Oh. 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 I wonder who those Tanakhs are keeping watch hey, for. Stranger. That's what we're gonna go find. Are you looking out. to trade? That was, that was like a sad one, you know, especially if you've had a. Especially if you had like an older grandparent or parents. If those raiders can float out to sea, they can float back. Who are these raiders you're talking about? Some of Regala's supporters were hunted down near here. 
Most fought to the death, but one group had other ideas. They escaped pursuit and raided Tide's Reach. They were last seen out to sea to the west. The raiders escaped out to sea? We think that's why they raided the settlement. They built a, a flat boat. Bits of wood tied together. A uh, raft? I wouldn't want to go to sea on one. But it <laughs> seems that was the raiders' plan. Slaughter our sleeping guards, steal supplies, and sail straight west. Are you worried they might come back? The supplies they stole won't last forever, and they were prepared to gut our guards to get them. People here want justice. That won't happen until those fugitives are found. If the raiders went out to sea, I'm mm -hmm. not sure how I could follow them. I guess they got away. For now. Oh, is it on hold? Yeah, it is. We have so many things, like, on hold. <laughs> Well, I'm calling that one there. I feel like the last two episodes we got a ton done. It was a ton of fun, too. We did a lot of really cool side quests that I'm really glad we did. We got to see the base that the Zeniths are holding up in, which is also really crazy. So, yeah, I'm really glad that we did all that. I probably will do the next episode as the main mission. I feel I'm scared. It feels like we're getting near the end, but hopefully not too soon. There's still so much I need to do. <laughs> But, but yeah, a huge thanks to all my patrons and I will see you guys in the next one.